day two. Three. Day three of the breakfast challenge. Day three. No, nah, yep. Gasless challenge. <laughs> I think it's going pretty well. Here, mate. Oh, yeah? A bit of breaky, bud. You're going along with a finger roll and No, yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not finger roll. No, I'll still go. Oh. It's going to be messy. Sort of all about here. I'm going to go. You don't know what you're going to go there. No. Hash brown. Oh, some salt with that, buzz? Yes, please. Woohoo! Pepper? Get some pepper out, too. Egg. Oh. Oh, and mushrooms. Go on then. Garlic butter mushrooms. Oh! Never. No. Oh, bacon. Jeez, how dare I? <laughs> Look at that. Big breakfast for a big boy. Gary's having cornflakes again. How are they going, guys? Yes, yes. Alrighty, good morning, guys. Day three. Well, to Geraldton's our, um, will be our goal today. Yep. We should be able to get it, I reckon. Yeah, I think so. Easily in one day. We did it in a weekend the other, but that was stuffing around a bit, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Taking our time, snorkeling. Exactly. Right. So we'll probably still do that today, but yep. right yeah, on. we'll still get it in a day. Be easier, I yeah, I think so. No, well, even with stopping a little bit and yeah. stuff like that. Gaz, you're going to bloody love this drive, mate. Yeah. So you right down your alley. So yeah, you can show us where you're going. A bit better than yesterday's, yesterday's track anyway, that's for sure. <laughs> Today will be a nice little scenic drive. So yeah, exactly. We know it at this time. Okay. So, yeah, um, got a bit hectic yesterday. It did a little bit, didn't it? <laughs> a few broken things here and there. But so, really Nathan, why aren't you happy this morning? Your chair wouldn't fold up. Right? <laughs> I got it folded up. I just jumped on it. And here's Mitchie. Mitchie's just going for a play in the dunes. But Kramer got angry at his... Um, I wish I got that on film. <laughs> I wish I got that on film. Trying to fold it and snap. And he just threw it. Straight on the roof rack. Yeah, exactly. But anyway, what do you reckon? We bloody get moving. Let's go. Yes, what do you reckon, Mitchie? Yeah! <laughs> Righto, just left camp. What a beautiful spot that was. I think before we start heading to Geraldton, I think we're going to start by having a bit of a play in these dunes. They're too hard to pass up, to be honest. So let's have a crack at these, and then we'll move on. I think Mitch wants to do a bit of a fish on the way to, the, um, to Geraldton anyway. So Absol not, a, well, not many clouds in the sky. It's a beautiful sunny day. So let's get out there and enjoy it. See you soon. Day two, three, three, day three. <laughs> Jeez, time flies when you're having fun. It does, doesn't it? 
found some nice little gutters along here. You'll notice there's a couple of cray pots sitting out here, so that means there's a nice little reef system, obviously. Uh, cuts you into some nice, real deep water where we don't have to sort of go too far, and the surf doesn't look too bad. So, uh, me, young guys, Pete, and Nathan, we're going to throw uh, a couple of enticers out there and see if we can't entice them. Yeah. <laughs>
safe zone now. Um, Gary and Kreber have gone off for a bit of a full drive. It's just me and Mitch now. I'm sitting here watching Mitch fish. Hopefully he comes up with the goods. <laughs> He's going to try anyway. Uh, I think the plan is just to sit here and fish for a while, let those boys do their thing. Then they'll come back and then we'll find the camp for sure because it's getting on the bloody half past four now. So beautiful day though. Absolute beautiful day, isn't it, mate? Get this big old rod out there, see if we can't catch anything. We'll let you know. Hopefully come up with something. Found camp. Gary, what have you got going on? Big hole in my pants, that's what I've got going on. Going this way. <laughs> Righto guys, we found camp finally after a couple of little dramas, but we're all good. Um, Gary has a, what, you got two lamb, fresh lamb. I'm talking he's got a brother-in-law that gives him fresh lamb. You got a lamb roast going on in my camp oven, so that's mine. That's my dinner if I wanted it. <laughs> No, nah, it's not. Ours? Our dinner? Our dinner, because it's gasless. It certainly is. <laughs> Night three of the gasless challenge, we're making corn fritters and lamb chops. Lamb yeah. chops. Yeah. So lamb chops, fancy, sing it. along. Let's throw this garlic in. Yeah, no, yeah. Get in there. that in there. Yeah. There There's some in the batter as well. Beautiful. That smoke doesn't hurt my eyes at all. Nah, nah. Yeah, you guys all clean the knife and the chalkboard and that, you're strong. Got these lamb roasts on the go here, two of them, in the one pot, which I feel like is a bad decision already, but try and keep it going. I'm going to replace the coals now. See how we go. Hopefully it might be a bit too hectic for one of them. Right. <coughs> Trial and error. There you go. Grab one right, yeah. turn it on his trivet. Tongans. Right, I'll try some veggies. I've never done it like this, so people have to be with me. We want to. Uh, let's go and get a bit more wood. Another thing I thought I'd mention, got given these lights. They're magnetic on the bottom from an uh, Aussie company called Earth Track. Yeah, that, they actually gave it to us to, to try out and review. It's a portable, magnetic, rechargeable work light. So that's the full, that's dimmed, and there's an SOS function as well. We'll probably do a review on these actually, but look, have a look, they're magnetic. Boom, side of the car, done. I'll probably do a review on these once we've used them a little bit. We've used them for the last two or three trips. Let's see how they go. Yeah, I like getting, like getting behind companies that are wicked. Oh shit. But let's check it out. Let's go and get some bloody firewood, eh? So we've got the roast done. Beautiful, my my dad. Just, uh, the apparatus that I have to get through it is a bit difficult, but later. Oh. And I got gravy there too, you didn't even dip in the gravy. Damn it. That's basically just the juices from the roast. Beautiful. And a bit of a Mitch's grey box that he had in the in the car there. So. Thank you, Trav. Yeah, spot on. Thanks mate. for the lamb, Trevi. 
Beautiful, beautiful guys. Morning of day four. Uh, we've just popped into Geraldton, quickly gotten uh, some supplies. Now we're down here at the Greenwich River, just about to cross over and see what, what's to offer down that side of the coast. Uh, <laughs> you can have a fish, don't you, mate? Nah, no, well, we're back. <laughs> yeah, we'll probably try and hit up the, uh, the opposite side, the south side of the river. It looks like there's a couple of tracks. I've never been down there, but yeah, plenty of tracks are heading out and out on the Hamer. Uh, nature trails, so I'm hoping they sort of open up and people drive as well. But uh, nature's pretty keen to get some room. Yes. Uh, I'll get nothing. I'll try. <laughs> get the drone in the air and probably get some footage from the drone. Yep. But anyway, guys, <laughs> we're going to cross this river and off we go, boys. Eh? Well, hopefully, this eventuates to something because um, that was an awesome river to cross. Just a beautiful each side, ocean one side, river the other. Um, so now we, we climbed up this beautiful dune on the way in as you'll see from the footage got some awesome awesome shots and it was there were three nice tracks and it, and it also a chicken track as well which i should have taken because my jerry's went flying everywhere and also yesterday when we were playing in the dunes i cracked a jerry um and it spilt diesel all over me car so i'm as high as a kite driving through here <laughs> so now yet yeah, we're just going to keep going along the um the coast tracks or the river tracks just to see how far we can get down wish us luck <laughs> momentum so Mitch is sort of just on a bit of an angle where he could sort of slip down there so what we're going to do going to winch off of um, Creeper's car and throw match tracks underneath his back wheels just to keep his back wheels straight and stop slipping from down the bottom there anyway let's get on to it
got out of that one. <laughs> Good on, boys. Righto, Gary's turn now. We got Mitch out, thank Christ. Got max tracks laid out on the um, track and then we just moved a bit of the higher sand to the lower sand to try and level it out. And he's just gonna hit it with a bit of momentum now. Fingers crossed, baby. <laughs> Loving it. Beautiful. Sweet, sweet. <laughs> that there was, uh, you bum pucker a bit. Gets the old heart, take the gun. <laughs>mission this has turned out to be it is now four o'clock and we've just as you can see back there off the uh, beach we've trying to go up that hill trying to get off the beach I've never seen anything so soft we've been trying to get off the beach for I reckon over three and a half to four hours um, <laughs> I've never seen anything like it and the, the cruisers and everything they're quite heavy like the 200 series are very very heavy they just sort of like they just kept sliding down kept sliding down and then we've just gotten um, gotten back here and then Kreeb's rolled a tire off his rim. Gary rolled a tire off of his rim as well because we were down to eight pound. Eight pound, but now we're sort of on our way back now, find a camp, uh, having a bloody ball. Oh, well, I am. <laughs> I think we're all a bit tired, but geez, better than working. <laughs> you reckon, Mick? <laughs> Do you feel like a beer? Very, very stiff. stiff oh god, you look Straight like you, you look like you've been dropped and kicked. Looks like it's warm. Come on, you spit it up. So you've popped it off both sides of the beach. Well Nathan, you don't do bloody things in harms, do you mate? No nah, mate. You don't rip the beat off of one side, you rip it off a of bloody base, don't Alright, let's dig it out. G'day mate. What are you doing? Just cooking up a barbie mate. We're doing something a little bit different today and tonight. We've, uh, what are you using to heat that plate mate? We cheated. We failed. We failed. Miserably. I'll put a fire under there really. It's, it's a fire. At the... What is for dinner though? Uh, we're going to have just a big cook up of whatever's left, it's the last night, so we're going to try to do some pizzas on here, something different, and um, 
Just some nice wraps, mate. Sausages, bacon, eggs. All the good stuff. How about you, bud? What's for dinner? Uh, I'm cooking for me and Gads. We got <clears throat> steak wraps, fish wraps, and a cup of good old uh, chicken noodle soup. Beautiful. Righto, guys. We're here now. We made it as far as uh, the S Bend. S Bend just out of Jilton. It was a pretty <laughs> hectic day. I think hectic. we cut about 50 kilometres off our trip. <laughs> so, God, it's going to be great going home. It took us only about five hours to do about yeah. five k. <laughs> it about did, four you'll hours see, of yeah. being bogged. Yeah, exactly. You'll see from that footage, that was pretty hectic. That was. But, yeah. we, it, awesome trip. Awesome trip. But I wanted to run through these guys with their favourite... Um, what their favourite part of the trip was. <laughs> Starting in the front row, Gary. <laughs> what was your favourite part, bud? I tell you what, finding that track up on the ridge there in the mountains. Yeah. Oh. When you see the drone footage of that. Like, that was yeah, nice, actually. Sorry. That was weird. That was... That was awesome. Yeah, it was. So, so picturesque. Bit, absolutely. Picturesque. Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. Um, Mitch? Uh, probably camping last night in the dunes. That was a nice That spot. was nice. I, yeah. That was just out of Geraldton. Yeah, yeah just first just June system out of Geraldton. Yeah, just... Crowbar, how about you, mate? What was your favourite? Nah, I probably can't think of a favourite moment, mate. The whole trip's been pretty good. Yep. Yeah. Um, even though we broke some things and <laughs> shit happened. And, <laughs> well, that's every WA camping event. Yeah, nah. Video. Yeah, no, nah, you're right. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, nah, you're right. Well, I must admit, my favourite was um, the first time to Lucky. That was my first time to Lucky Bay. And just the weather, the weather that night, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Um, oh no, sorry for my, for mine would be that mud flat to going yeah. along there. No, yeah. like yeah. no, yeah. watching you guys. Oh, I was going to say that because you're the only one who didn't get bogged. Yeah, <laughs> going up there because um, I was just late. Going up that dried out river bit was pretty cool too. That was yeah. that was pretty good. Actually, that yeah, I got some good footage of that as well. Yeah. I wish we would have camped, time, yeah, so yeah, we cool camped there one time. Yep. As always, guys, thanks so much for watching. We hope you enjoy. If there's anything uh, you have to ask, post them in the comments below. Um, and I guess we'll see you on the next trip. Thanks for watching. Cheers, guys.